We turn now to the deadly mass shooting in Las Vegas. Senator Dianne Feinstein joins us from San Francisco. Senator, you're supporting a bill that would ban these bump fire stocks. Do you have any Republican support for that bill? We have Republican interest. I have nobody lined up. Uh, we have 38 co-sponsors. They're all Democratic. Uh, we've had individuals that have indicated an interest and particularly for a hearing. The NRA put out a statement on Thursday suggesting they would support looking into regulations that would keep these bump fire stocks from being sold. What did you make of that position? Well, I thought that's a step forward and it's, appreciate, it's appreciated. Regulations aren't going to do it. We need a law. It can't be changed by another president. Right now we're seeing one president change actions of a, of a president that came before him. And that would happen in this area. And I hope that Americans will step up and say, enough is enough, Congress do something. What do you make of the increased sales of bump fire stocks in the wake of the shooting and then yeah. now legislation? See, I don't know what to make of it. Um, what this event said, uh, th this is a well-to-do man. He wasn't mentally ill. Um, he wasn't a criminal. He wasn't a juvenile. He wasn't a gangbanger. And he was able to buy 40 weapons over a period of time, have 12 bump stocks, line them up, break through two windows in his hotel suite, and take aim at tens of thousands, well, I guess tw uh, over a thousand people uh, at a concert. And this was such a cross section of America that it really struck at every one of us that this could happen to you, and we want to stop it. Could there have been any law passed that would have stopped him? No, um, he, he passed uh, background checks registering for handguns and other weapons uh, on multiple occasions.